What is going on, guys? Boy, I'm the slash how do I sign in one back here today with another video. Uh, I just recorded the video and realized that I didn't have the storage on my phone, so I highly tried to apologize. But for the final fucking second time, <clears throat> we're gonna try to do this. And basically, guys, do not update your dashboard. Um, this has been out for the past 48 hours at least. Um, yeah, just don't update your dashboard. It will save you guys a whole bunch of hassle in the long end. Because it's just been a severe pain in the ass. Uh, I updated my dashboard because an uh, XE build came out for it, and it corrupted my NAND. Uh, I did it twice in a row just to try to bypass it, and it, it did not work. So, how do I say this? Yeah, just don't update it. Fuck it. Um, wait at least two to three more days before I update it. Um, you guys can update it, but you got an avatar update. You especially you still got to do. So, if you got a piece, uh, if you got a hard drive, you just don't give a shit about. Format it. Switch everything over really quick. Don't like switch games or nothing. But just do dash launch and all that shit. Get a hard drive you don't give a fuck about. Update it that way. Then pull the hard drive. And slap it back in. What saved my ass, and I'm serious about this, is putting a launch INI on a flash drive and putting putting it in the console, like pushing it in and putting the old hard drive in it that broke, <clears throat> and using the launch INI off that. That the hard drive still um, links to the console, guys. But it will bring up an error code for E yeah E seventy one, which means the red ring of death for the hard drive slash format issue. Um, luckily, it wasn't the Xbox. Um, it was just the hard drive. Um, so basically, what I did is I had an old um computer hard drive laying around, and I formatted it to the Xbox. And now I'm gonna currently switch everything over to it. Um, which means all my games. Right now, currently, Black Ops 3 is transferring. As you see. Um, and I already transferred Modern Warfare 2 and everything else. But basically, what I'm doing is putting all my games on a computer, on my computer, in a folder. Then I'm gonna transfer everything over to the hard drive on the Xbox, which uh, could take time. But you know what? Stuff like this happens. Uh, just luckily I had a thinking cap on and thought up this idea. So, um, yeah, um, guys, um, just be careful on how you update your Xbox from now on. Um, do the, I highly suggest updating it, then doing an avatar update straight after you get done, and, um, be careful on how you update it from now on, because, uh, for some reason, uh, XC builds are having problems with the kernel, and it fucked, uh, probably a good 20 people up. Uh, you can break your console by updating this, just letting you know. Uh, it breaks my fucking NAND, so luckily it wasn't the Xbox NAND, it was just the hard drive part of the NAND, and I was able to rewrite it and save it through a simple 360 NAND flash here. So, yeah guys, thumbs up on the video, leave a like down below, and subscribe to the channel if you guys um, like this video. Um, and if you guys have any other problems, uh, leave a comment below. If you guys got a, just a, if you guys got any problems, just leave a comment below. I will leave a comment down below, link to my Skype, and I I will hopefully be able to help you guys out in some way or form. Uh, if not, I apologize, but I will try my best to help you guys out. Or I will send you to somebody that may know somebody. Um, if you guys have kick, I will leave my kick down below as well. But actually, no, I won't leave my kick down below. I will actually uh, recommend somebody for the help. And yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And we'll see you guys later.